Welcome family and friends. Contrary to popular belief, we are not here today to celebrate Bilbo's 111th birthday. <laughs> Instead, we are gathered here today to witness and celebrate the marriage of Megan and Cody. This is not the beginning of a new relationship, but an acknowledgement of the next chapter in their lives together. Um, I want to address Cody first. Uh, it's no surprise that me and Megan were big fans of you before she ever even met you. And for those of you that don't know, me and Megan used to ride to school every day singing the songs from Cody's band at the top of our lungs, joking that we'd be roadies or groupies or something. And so I'll never forget when Megan told me that she went on a date with you for the first time. It went a little something like this. Jesse, guess what? I went on a date with this guy and he's exactly like me. He's nerdy, he loves video games, and he's hot. Because, you know, you never get those two things together sometimes. But then she told me that you were in the band that we listened to that defined our teenage angst, and I just knew that was it. That was it. Cody, as you know, is quite the nerd. So naturally, we were worried that he'd never find someone on the same level as him. Level 130, Paladin. But then Megan entered the picture. Bonding over ping pong, Lord of the Rings. Perfectly reasonable obsession with a Baja Blast. It wasn't long until Cody was clearly in love. But come on, what's not to love about Mooks? <laughs> She's always down for anything. Hilariously fun to be around. A beautiful singing voice. So incredibly easy to scare. And absolutely stunning tonight. Hey! <laughs> It's fair to say that we've all fallen in love with Megan, and we're all in love with the two of you together. So let's raid a dungeon. Let's raise a glass <laughs> to Cody and Megan. Love we love you guys. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Cody Easterling.